Hey, my good friends, Sam Haymart with Test Driven TV. We just got the all new 2024 Subaru Impreza into the garage. And so we're gonna take a tour under hood and outline all of the major technical items as well as the maintenance service points. For 2024, the Subaru Impreza comes with two engines. The base two liter horizontally opposed boxer four cylinder engine with 152 horsepower and 145 pound feet of torque for the base and the sport trim grades. On the RS model that we've got here, it features an identical looking 2.5 liter version with 182 horsepower and 178 pound feet of torque, a significant increase over the standard two liter engine. Here it's mated to the Linear Tronic continuously variable transmission and features Subaru's trademark symmetrical all-wheel drive. EPA fuel economy ratings are similar to the smaller engine with 26 MPG city, 33 highway, and 29 MPG combined, only one mile per gallon different. The 2.5 liter engine is rated for regular unleaded fuel and employs an idle start-stop system to help it achieve better fuel economy and lower emissions. Following the airflow, the engine breathes through a snorkel located at the top of the front radiator support. Air flows back into the air filter box located at the front passenger side of the engine compartment and then rearward to a single bore throttle body. The composite plastic intake manifold then divides the airflow to either side of the flat four cylinder engine's two cylinder bays. The engine features full aluminum construction of block and heads. Two cams on each head feature variable timing. Exhaust then exits the heads at the bottom of the engine on both sides and immediately into the catalyst system, which largely cannot be seen from the engine compartment. You can, however, see behind the engine, the front half of the transmission and the axle shafts. In spite of being tightly packed, the engine compartment is laid out well for service and maintenance. The engine oil dipstick is located on the top passenger side of the engine right up front. Looking down below, a single serpentine belt provides for all of the accessories and shows plenty of room for access when it comes time to replace it. At the driver's side front of the engine is the oil filler cap and also the oil filter itself for easy access. Located nearby are also the windshield washer fluid and the engine coolant reservoirs. Behind these are the 12 volt battery which is also easy to access and service. On the driver's side wheel well is the main fuse box which can be accessed by pressing a tab at the rear and the front. Inside, you'll find a small fuse removal tool provided at the fuse block in addition to a few additional fuses stowed in the cover, just in case. The engine control unit, or ECU, is located adjacent to the fuse box. The brake fluid reservoir is located at the driver's side rear of the engine bay and requires no gymnastics to get to. Notable underneath is its electronic power brake motor unit. Other braking components under the hood include the ABS control unit, which typically requires no service or maintenance. Changing your air filter is done at the front passenger side of the engine bay by simply removing two clips, pushing the box open and lifting it out. We have a separate video on that linked down below in the information section. Lastly, looking forward, you'll see dual electric cooling fans at the radiator. Always keep your hands clear, even if the engine's powered off. All right, my friends, there you go for under the hood of the 2024 Subaru Impreza, the Crosstrek identical. Now, if you've been around Subarus for a while, this doesn't really look all new at all it looks just like the old ones for quite some time back they don't change very much but just little things along the way now as i mentioned we do have a video link down below in the information section for how to change the air filter and you can also see right there our test drive on this new 24 model you can also subscribe to our youtube channel right there by the way stay tuned